you know, one of the reasons for our existence is to smash stereotypes. All kinds of stereotypes. Women are bad drivers, women are bad with numbers, women don't want to work hard, women are conscious of, uh, they don't want to travel. I mean, this is all nonsense. I really think stereotypes have to be broken very consciously. I'll give you a small example. There is this big belief that women don't help other women, right? We did a survey and we've promised ourselves that if I haven't experienced that, then if somebody else says it, I'm going to step up and say, not true for me. Because we have to chip away at breaking stereotypes, smashing stereotypes at every opportunity if we have to have a more unbiased and more equal world for women. One of the things that we see a lot at Vedika, you know, girls come in, it's a management program. And then there's this underlying murmur about finding quant stuff. And I think the stereotype about women not being good with numbers just feeds into this fear. And it's completely misplaced. Uh, like I've said in other places, everything can be learned. Okay, you may have the aptitude, a greater aptitude for uh, language over numbers or a greater aptitude for numbers over language, but nothing tells me that every woman can't be good at numbers. We started with great communication. We have a communication center. We've seen great results. And in an effort to one, break the stereotype, but also I want recruiters to say two years out, you know what, these Vedika girls, they are excellent at language and communication and they are as good with numbers so this move between communication and numbers should be seamless uh, and so we've launched the vedika quant center now and saying you know what if you feel a little bit hesitant we'll help you with it so we do a baselining and depending on the aptitude and the level of skill with numbers we have a great team of people who are now working with our students uh, the vedika scholars to ensure that the delta on the comfort with numbers is as big as it is on communication and the overall transformation of our of our scholars.